hi it is time to go red again um let's just ignore what i said in my last video about having me making more christmas videos i'm actually in quarantine right now so no more going out for me for like another week it has been two months since i have dyed my hair red um of course feel free to check out that video if you are interested and it is time to do my roots so i'm just gonna like dye proof this entire area because i know i'm gonna make a mess i'm gonna change or we're gonna get dyed i have successfully mariah proofed my environment i have these old towels i use specifically for my hair i have one laid on my desk i have one behind me on my chair and i'm going to lay one on myself i have my bleach powder and developer which i am going to dilute once again with my formula last time i did this i underestimated the lightening capabilities of this bleach a lot and my hair lightened more than i needed it to as you can see so i'm going to try and dilute it to a 20 instead of a 30. of course my hair dye some hair ties some clips and of course a scale and a mirror so let's begin don't forget your brush okay this is what my hair is looking like i have about an inch i think i would say i know i don't really understand american measurements so the mixing ratio for this these two products is one is to 1.5 up to one is to 2.5 in order for me to dilute this first of all i need to do my formula so so the developer i have is 40 volume the developer i want is 20 40 minus 20 is 20. therefore we're going to take the last two numbers which is 20 20 remove the zero which is two is to two and we're just going to simplify that to one is to one it's easy to go. i remember that smell okay so 40 grams 40 multiplied by 1.5 is 60 so we're gonna go with 60 grams of peroxide and we're gonna add 60 grams of water boom i am not a hairdresser so i do not condone doing this i've been doing this for a long time however yes my hair is damaged yes sometimes it snaps off but it's still on my head I've been using this diluting formula for a long ass time, so I know what works for me. And I've been getting comments like, why did you use 40 volume? You know, you're not supposed to. I know I'm not supposed to. That's why I dilute it. Like. Okay, let's begin. I'm just gonna clip my baby hairs. Cause, do not want to touch those for now. I'm so nervous, holy fuck. How come, I used to be so confident in doing this, but then again, I wasn't that afraid to fuck up my hair. Now I kind of am. Okay. Can't really see the back of my head, but I can still sort of manage if I pull sections and bring them to the side. Ah, my sensory issues are going crazy right now with these gloves. Ah, shit. Before, I oh, I didn't know that I had sensory issues like two years ago, three years ago when I used to film videos and take off my gloves so i didn't know how to like tell people like bro i can't wear my gloves we're gonna do this side now once again leaving a tiny bit of space for the roots 
Sorry about the noise, it's a plane. Yeah, you can see that it's still brown, whereas last time it was orange. At this point, almost blonde. So I think at this point they could start going up to the roots of it. Saturated. So I actually found this like towel head wrap thingy I haven't used in years. So I just put that on for some insulation, I guess. Um, and since I have nothing better to do, I'm actually gonna mix up my color. Since this is semi-permanent, you could mix it up as long as you want from before and it's not gonna activate because it's just color. I have my clean beaker. So here are my colors. I have rich amber, intense red and crimson. So let's mix it up. So this is what we're working with. Should be enough. An entire bottle is 118. And I have about 130 grams in here. So it should be enough. If not, I'll just add more. I kind of lost my measurements, to be honest. It smells amazing, once again. Look at that eye twitch. I am going to check. <sighs> Okay, I think we are done. <laughs> Damn, that was just 10 minutes since I finished applying everything. And yeah, this is done. I'm going to go wash this out and come back. Okay, hair has been washed. Let's take this out and apply the dye. Okay, let me just wipe off my face. Thoroughly applied the hair dye. And I gave it like an all over coat with the intense red because I ran out of the mixture. Good thing I'm in quarantine because my face is going to be stained for the next week. And for sure, people at work are going to be like, You are in quarantine, what the fuck? Why did you dye your hair? Bro, I do it myself. Oh my god, really? I am going to let this sit for. 30 minutes and then I am going to apply the Olaplex number zero all over my towel dried hair, leave that on for 10 minutes and I'm gonna rinse that out and apply the Olaplex number three and leave that on for as long as I can and then I'm going to stand my hair and come back and show you the result. Okay, it's looking dark on camera. Let me zoom out a bit so you can see the roots. So we have some hot roots happening once again, but that's normal. 
um the ends are looking very dark especially on camera i can't really show you guys what it looks like during daytime because it's pretty dark now um let's see if i can reflect some light uh but i am obsessed and my hair feels amazing also i want to add like one final touch so i got these like butterfly clips from aliexpress just watch this okay i actually got these for a festival look how cute these are anyways yeah that is me touching up my roots once again after two months um yeah there we go you can kind of see it at this angle so yeah uh i am obsessed to say the least i am so happy my hair feels amazing so glad i repurchased the olaplex number three as always if you are not updated but you would like to be make sure to check out my instagram at marzi 2 rs 2 ss as well as my tiktok because i am posting on there quite not a lot but i'm cause i'm posting a different content than i am here sometimes and that is mariah m a double r underscore i a h and of course i will see you again for another video bye guys Thank you.